Tributes on the let Kenneth Matiba continues to flow in from various quarters. We now cross over to live to Charles Rubia, who worked hand in hand with Matiba in the second liberation. Rubia is speaking to K10 reporter Shadrach Miti. All right, he, uh, we are aware that uh, the late Kenneth Matiba died yesterday following an illness, and he is one of the forefathers of democracy. Let's now cross over where reporter Shadrach Miti is speaking to Charles Rubia, who is the former mayor of Nairobi on the late Kenneth Matiba. I went for operation in London. So, um, but that is the match on my church and so on. But all the time then, I can tell you, my family and my family, my people, well, and even Raila Odinga, because Raila was also detained, I think about the same time. Um, there were some papers I, I have where Matiba's family and uh, uh, Raila's, Aida, and my late wife, my wife died. So, uh, they were meeting, we have made some appeal to government. I've got a copy of their appeal <laughs> for release. But let me repeat once again, I feel very sorry about Matiba's death. In a way, because I've taken you all along, Matiba and I, I feel lonely now. It's, it's uh, it's a funny thing to say, maybe, but it was only he and I who signed that press statement of the first one. And I think it was he and I only who were detained for asking for multi party. Others had some other reasons. My own detention order mentioned it exactly that, that I was calling a meeting of Saba Saba. <laughs> Just when I was released, I thought I better beat a clock. <laughs> and he called it Sava Sava. <laughs> so I feel very sad about Montima's death because I was all the time hoping that he would recover. Um, I myself was you know, a bit okay in a way. But I can tell you, I live on medicine. My medical bills monthly is very high. Uh, what you see now in me is maintained by the medicines. <laughs> there are some medicines, if I don't take them, I'll go down. So I feel now my tip is gone. Uh, I feel lonely. I feel very sad. I don't know how, how to express this. Because he was, he was sick. And I was there, but I was hoping one day we can. There was a time I went to see him uh, at his place in Nemuru. All right, that is Charles Rubia, former mayor of Nairobi, just sharing how exactly he remembers the late Kenneth Matiba. We'll be going back to him shortly. But to